Power Rangers has some amazing suits in it. And today, I'm going to give you my opinion on the 10 greatest suits in Power Rangers. Uh, this is not going to include like special power-up suits, battleizers, things of that nature. Uh, so if you want to see that, maybe I'll make another video ranking those. But this is base suits. One suit that maybe isn't considered base, but I'll get into it. Um, but starting off with number 10. I went with the Green Spirit Ranger from Jungle Fury. The Jungle Fury Rangers, they're all, all their suits are honestly pretty good, but the Spirit Rangers especially, um, it's just, just something so nice to it. This color green isn't one we've seen in a suit that often in Power Rangers, and I think it works really well here. Uh, but the biggest standout to me is this helmet. This is just like, a, I don't know how to describe it, just a real warrior's helmet. Um, it, the, the little mini tusks that are coming out look really great. Um, but just that, that color green complements that white very well that all the Spirit Rangers have. So number 10, I'm going with the green Spirit Ranger. Number 9, I have the Aqua Ranger from Dino Charge. Um, I just, I think it's mostly like the ears. Honestly, I think I just find them... Uh, cute uh, almost I mean just but this blue is a real nice one um, a more subdued one that we've seen not quite this shade before I mean I think I'm think alien ranger was close Tories might have been a little close in terms of it but this this blue works so well in a suit as like the primary color of it um, the helmet is probably a top five helmet for me in power rangers and helmets are going to go a long way in this uh, so I'm going aqua ranger from dino charge at number nine Number eight, I went with Mystic Force Green Ranger, Xander suit. Uh, the bull logo on the helmet is great. Um, I think the green goes really well with the black striping that all the suits have and the little gold accent. Um, the capes, I don't think every Ranger suit needs a cape, but maybe we could get a couple more in there in Power Rangers because I think Mystic Force did a great job with the capes. Um, but yeah, I'm going green Mystic Force Ranger at number eight number seven number seven i'm this is the one that might not be considered a base suit but i'm going with uh pink ninja power suit uh from mighty morphin uh kimberly i love kimberly she looks great in it i like kimberly more than cat but for this specifically i'm gonna give it to cat specifically maybe it's just the blonde hair goes with some of the yellow accents the gold like the gold emblem they have on the chest a little better um but yeah i Something about the ninja robes here, I, I wanted to have some representation of them because I do like them a lot. And uh, if if I have this one, maybe I could have had some of the other, um, like, suits that Power Rangers wear, like the, the Mystic Force, like, training suits, the Jungle Fury coats. But I was like, they actually do, like, ranger shit in these, so I decided to count them, unlike some of those other suits. Although they do fight in them, but, like, ranger ring which is a little different to me. I feel like they do more in these suits. But, uh, yeah, just something about it I really like. I like the headbands. Very, It's like very 90s. I don't think, I don't know if they would do it nowadays, but I, I like the headbands. Um, but, yeah, I'm giving this slot to Ninja Power Pink specifically. Number six, a season I'm very critical of, and a Ranger specifically I genuinely just do not like. I know he has his fan base, but number six, I got the Red Samurai Ranger. Um, as much as I hate samurai is a season aesthetically it's one of the best seasons including the suits i like the kind of like robe stripes that they kind of have that kind of look like the y i really like that the black pants i think work really well in this suit and then just the kanji symbols on the helmet is is really good um this is this is a season i've been very critical of but it's just story wise acting wise directing wise but aesthetically great season and then at number five i have the crimson ranger from Ninja Storm, the Crimson Thunder Ranger. Um, I just the shoulder pads look great. This crimson w works really well. It's, it's it's another color we haven't seen like too much in Power Rangers, which maybe adds to the specialty of it that raises it on the list. Uh, the beetle ornament on its head looks great. I mean, this suit is just it's just it's so good. I mean, the only thing is I don't know how I feel about the knee pads. That might be the only thing I kind of dislike, but overall, this suit is amazing. Number four, I went with the Quantum Ranger from Time Force. I just love the jaggedness of the arrow, especially in comparison to the other Rangers in the season. Um, this red and black just works 
so well together. It just some some of this is the aura that the Ranger themselves exude that you would kind of associate with the suit, and Eric is one of those guys that does that. Um, but yeah, the Quantum Ranger. I would be interested to see what a full team of Quantum Rangers look like. I know it wouldn't be too dissimilar from what the Time Force Rangers look like, given how similar this suit is to the Red Time Force suit, but I would still want to see it just because of how this suit looks. But yeah, Quantum Ranger number four. And number three, I have RJ's Wolf Ranger suit from Jungle Fury. Now, Jungle Fury is the only season, I think, that has two entries on this list, which is a little surprising even to me because I think I'll get into which season I think has the best suits at the end. Um, and there's a suit from that season that probably could have made this list. So Jungle Fury has some good representation here. But Jungle Fury, this suit is... I just love it. Purple is my favorite color. This is the best Purple Ranger we've gotten in the show. Wolf is is one of my favorite animals, especially what it lends to some stuff aesthetically. This helmet is great. I mean, the only thing is like the snout that they kind of give it. If you look at it for a second, it kind of looks like a weird smiley face, which kind of throws me off. But overall, I think the helmet is amazing. Obviously, I love the color. Um, yeah, this suit is top three for me. Uh, but moving on to number two, I went with the green Mighty Morphin suit. Uh, this is the most iconic suit in all of Power Rangers, and for good reason. Uh, the green pops really well. Uh, the gold chest plate that this has is iconic. Um, it was always great seeing the chest plate on other suits, but it, it, it fit best on the green. And this helmet, the dragon helmet, is probably a top three helmet in Power Rangers as well, which, like I said, carries a lot. The little red, em like, diamond emerald thing on the top of its head. Um, but yeah, this is the most iconic suit in Power Rangers. Uh, there's just an aura to this suit because of what happens with it. Um, but yeah, I have to put this one at number two. Now, this list probably should have been a top 20 because there are that many good suits in all of Power Rangers. So I'm going to rapid fire, and I mean rapid fire, all the other suits that I had written down that didn't quite make the list. I decided to just kind of scroll through all the suits. Every single one I saw that I thought could be top 10, I wrote down. And there's like so many suits here. So I'm going to very, very quickly rapid fire through all the suits here. Blue Zeo, Green Lost Galaxy, Pink Time Force, Blue Wild Force, Zeo Gold, Dino Thunder Black, Phantom Ranger, Black Wild Force, White Wild Force, Wolf Wild Force, Green Samurai from Ninja Storm, Shadow Ranger from SPD, Cat Ranger from SPD, White Mystic Force Ranger, uh, Leon Bow from Mystic Force, the Blue and Black Spirit Rangers from Jungle Fury, Black RPM, Green RPM, um, and there's a couple more suits I'm not going to mention because it'll give away what number one is. Number one, in my opinion, the greatest suit in all of Power Rangers, is the white Dino Thunder suit. This suit is perfect. I think this is the most, I think this is the perfect Power Ranger suit. Um, the big chest plate that he has, kind of uh, almost like a signature for extra slash sixth Rangers, even though he's the fifth. Um, the red visor is what ultimately sells this thing for me. I mean, I just, I, it just goes well with the white and the black. The, the zebra striping that it almost looks like just it goes so hard the boots i mean the spike along the helmet the shape of the visor i know i talked about the color but the shape of it ex specifically is so well done to me this is the best suit in all of power rangers and it's because dino thunder to me is the aesthetically the best suit i know i named the black dino thunder ranger specifically in honorable mentions but all the, the rest could be on here as well. I'm talking the red Dino Thunder, blue Dino Thunder, yellow Dino Thunder. Those could have been on this list easily as well. I just didn't want to um, overdo the list with the same season. But white Dino Thunder Ranger is the only action figure I have that like I, I explicitly bought. It's a small one that I saw at a store one time and I just had to get it. Um, I have some others. I have like green Mighty Morphin, white Mighty Morphin because like they came with the Zords that I bought. But to me, the white Dino Thunder suit is the best Power Rangers has to offer. But let me know what you thought. Uh, let me know down in the comments below what you agreed with most, what you disagreed with most, what you think the best suit in all of Power Rangers is. Um, go ahead and like this video. I'd really appreciate it. Subscribe because I got a lot more coming. Uh, if you want to see any other Power Rangers content or anything else you'd want to see me do, just comment that down below as well. Thank you so much for watching. And as always, keep gaming.